really disturbing turn. That is white supremacists make a show of force for Gabrielle Hansen. Good evening. Thank you for being with us. I'm Carrie Sharp. That group which showed up last night at a candidates forum has a reputation that stands in stark contrast to Franklin's reputation as a welcoming city. News Channel 5 Chief Investigative Reporter Phil Williams was there. And Phil, this is a group that has been on your radar for a while. Th th that is true. Still, the last thing that anyone had expected was for them to inject themselves into Franklin Alderman Gabrielle Hansen's campaign for mayor. Here in Franklin, Tennessee, a town that prides itself on its small town charm, area residents pack City Hall to hear from the candidates who want to run the town for the next four years. They were joined by nearly a dozen white supremacists. Someone said you were here making a statement. I don't know what that statement is. No, we're not uh, making a that? statement. We're here for uh, Gabrielle Hansen's statement. You are? Yeah. Okay. White supremacists so protecting a candidate who has made fighting LGBTQ pride events a focus of her campaign for mayor. Some were not too eager for their identities to be known. We're just making sure everything goes well. Okay, and are you concerned about things not going well? It's a possibility and we're just here to protect Gabrielle. You're, you're here to protect her? Yes. I hear you're all here for Gabrielle? Yes, yes sir. So, so what, what, what's the purpose? Uh, we're just here to show her some support, that's all. The man on the left is Sean Kaufman, who has been described by the Stop Anti-Semitism watchdog group as, quote, a disturbed neo-Nazi and Holocaust denier with a documented history of violence and a massive cache of firearms. A video posted online shows Kaufman and other extremists earlier this year outside a nonprofit group's drag show fundraiser. There's Kaufman giving a Nazi salute. He also showed up at a Chattanooga drag show last year with other extremists. In 2020, Kaufman was arrested for disorderly conduct at a Black Lives Matter protest. Gabrielle's a friend of mine, and uh, she's had some credible threats against her, so uh, he'll, uh, I'm just... Uh, Posted up out here. Okay. Show her some support. Then there's Brad Lewis. He's the operator of the Lewis Country Store on the far west side of Nashville, a store known for its extreme right wing messaging. When the store recently went on the market, Gabrielle Hansen was the real estate agent who got the listing. A recent investigation by the Southern Poverty Law Center revealed how the second floor of the store was being used as a white nationalist fight club calling himself an actual literal Nazi. Yeah. 